It's done. Great. How'd you do it? I just, uh, I hit it with a big old hammer. Oh, nice job, you little sociopath. Hey, I got another gig for you. You down? No. I get where you're coming from. I'm waiting for someone? You're waiting for me. You're my fiance? No. You don't have a fiance anymore. This is not how I wanted to start this. Wait, sorry. Mark? Mark has really enjoyed these last few years by your side. He will always the treasure the this? memories that you created in the bone. Are you, are you a surrogate? Are you breaking up with me for Mark? I am attempting to. And this is what you decided to wear? What? You're coming to deliver someone potentially the worst news of their life and you're dressed like you're in a Mormon biker gang. This isn't about me. Aren't you supposed to say it's not you, it's me? You're taking this really well. How does one even get this job? Break up concierge? What do you do, guy? Who are you? I'm not supposed to share personal details. This is the worst day of my life. I'm devastated. The love of my life has decided to break things off with me via teenager. I'm an adult. You're not going to personalize this experience at all for me. My name is Rabbit. No, it's not. I'm a freelancer. I do things that people pay me to do. So you're like a task rabbit. I do things a task rabbit wouldn't do. Okay, and the job du jour is to break up with me? Yes. Mark has really enjoyed these lines. Why? Why do this? It's either this or Grubhub. No, it isn't. It's honest work. No, it isn't. There are so many other things you could do. You chose this. I like this job. Why? Variety. So what's the range here, is it? Mostly breakups? Is it rarely breakups? Um, this is the first. That explains a lot. Is this over? Have you accepted the parting of the ways? Can I go? I thought you liked this job. I'm so ready for it to be over. What do you do? I'm a criminologist. I make most of my money as an expert witness. Oh. And I spend a lot of time studying people like you. I'm not a criminal. So everything you do is legal? You said, I do things a task rabbit wouldn't do. Those things, those are all legal? I'm not a law knower. Sounds like some pretty willful ignorance, rabbit. If that even is your real name. Which it's not. Um, hello, can I get you anything? Hello, Bloody Mary. Can I see some ID? Show her. Uh, oh, I, I, I don't have any on me. I'll just take a soda water. Are you sober? I don't bring my ID on jobs. I know my rice. No, you don't. So you're sober then, right? Recovery? Oh, I understand. Understand what? I get why you do this, Rabbit. You've experienced lying to people, getting your way. You need to fill your sober hours. I admit, this is probably a pretty exciting job. Not always fun, but neither is drug addiction. My only question then is, are you really sober if you're just trading the highs and lows of drug addiction for the highs and lows of whatever the job of the day is? This isn't a substance. I'm asking if you're a dry drunk. I'm asking what that means. It means you don't drink, but you exhibit the same behavior as an alcohol. It was an alcohol. So you are in recovery. What is it? Pills? I am not going to say. Coke. Mark has really enjoyed these letters. You look like you're going to cry. I'm not. I would be okay. I'm not going to do that. You are broken up with. It happened. Adieu, goodbye, Liz. You do the same job as I do. I break up with people. You're a freelancer. Someone pays you to say something and then you say it. Under oath. That's honest work. Yeah, but you do only say things that benefit the people who can afford to pay you. Well, yeah, or else they wouldn't hire me. That's not a moral victory. The difference here is that I do not lie, unlike you. And I do not do my job in order to validate myself or escape a soul-crushing coke addiction, unlike you. 
You ever sent anyone to the chair? The chair. <gasps> this is California. You really don't know the law. Oh, what a catch you are. You'll be fine. What was Mark thinking? Um, Liz, who was that guy? Where's Mark? Mark's gone. Oh? You're right. I never should have proposed to him. Thank you.